All right, Lady Ada. Yes, it's time for the new, 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 new. All right, new products this week. First one's an update. Yes, we've updated our budget kit for Raspberry Pi. It's now, and we have a version that's Raspberry Pi 4 friendly. It's got the official Raspberry Pi 4 case. Got the cobbler, breadboard, some um, breakout headers, and a USB-C power supply. Next up. We've got the acrylic add-on kits for your MagTag, so you don't need these, but it definitely makes your MagTag all fancier. You get two options of a front plate, either a fluffy, friendly cloud, or you can have a uh, jaunty crimson arrow. Uh, I don't know, you, you like the arrow design because it's always fun to have things on your fridge that it point could, at other It things. could be an arrow, it's a, it's a house. There's a all house? sorts of things it could be. All right, cool. Um, comes with also a little back plate and a bit of mounting hardware to attach it. You'll also want some a magnetic feet. Uh, all together, it is a great accessory add-on for your MagTag. All right, next product is a bunch of different products. Yeah, it's basically one product in different ways. So uh, some folks were emailing us and said, can you guys carry this very everyday perf board? Uh, so this generic perf board, it doesn't have you know, any wires between the pads, but it has just a big grid of uh, 0.1 inch um, plated through holes, double sided on FR4. Um, we also have like some perf board that's made with um, phenolic paper, so it's like less expensive and easier to cut. This one, this stuff is harder to cut, so you kind of like got to use it in the shape it is. You don't really want to saw it because uh, it's made out of fiberglass. Um, but it's nice and strong. It's got these like edge pads. I mean, these are kind of like, I mean, let's be honest. You used to be able to get these at like Radio Shack, but Radio Shack is kind of doesn't exist anymore. So um, instead, uh, we have uh, three different sizes, long and skinny, kind of medium rectangle and uh really rectangle yeah. so this 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 no there's this. A, there's only three of them yeah yeah that, so i'll show that, them on the that. yeah i'll show them on the overhead so you can see differences in, and you comes in a pack of three so uh you probably are like i could use a lot of these Hold on okay so uh this is the largest shape. And uh, what I kind of like is it has like the letters uh, across the top. This is like 20 by 18 or so. And then this one is smaller. So this is for like smaller builds. And this one is like, I don't know, like maybe a little like 20. That's no, right, this is like 23 by 18. And this is like 19 by 14. And then there's like this super skinny one that's uh, 28 by six. So three different sizes are kind of handy. I definitely like this small skinny size. It's like there's times when you want to make like something that's like handheld comfortable, like a wand type shape or like a, you know, something you point at something else. So it's gonna be kind of nice if you could have like LEDs or, or, you know, some sensor at the end of this and then your circuitry and then like a, a battery maybe on the back. So uh, handy little PCB packs. All right, next up. Okay, we've also got uh, two kits from uh, TechnoChic. Uh, folks really loved the uh, rainbow unicorn horn and um, was it the cat ears? I can't remember now. They had they had a fun, uh, easy to build kit that does not require a lot. Oh, sorry, it was the bow tie kit and the unicorn horn kit. And what's nice about these is they're they're not too expensive. They're about twenty bucks, but they're like really complete and very easy to build. Um, you don't need any special tools, kind of comes with everything you need. Um, and it's fairly easy to put together a good crafting afternoon or weekend. So the first project is this tutu, which it's the details. It's the, it's the sparkly sequined belt that it comes with. It's the multiple colors of tutu material. Um, it's the fact that it has like a little like built in pocket for the battery holder. Um, it's all the different colors that the LEDs sparkle in when you turn it on here. I'll turn it on and off so you can see. It has, it has these, um, you know, the LEDs, they're not reprogrammable. They kind of come as a, they do their own flicker animation. Um, so as long as they're on, they just, they just flicker through it. So uh, if you, this is probably not for a larger person. So it's meant for a younger person, like a kid or someone who's just about kid sized. Um, you want to make a beautiful glittering glowing tutu. Uh, it just uses everyday coin cell batteries that we sell. You can also just buy them at any grocery store. They're used for like remote controls and stuff. Uh, and you can make a wonderful little tutu that they can wear on gone. top of their clothes. 
So yeah, if you want to make wearable electronics that look great and are nice and durable, I um, I definitely like the construction of this kit. So yeah. it comes as pieces. If you have so, a young engineer, this is your uniform to wear also while you're doing yes. electronics and coding. Yes, I, if I, this had been around when I was a kid, I would have worn this while I was learning Unix. So it comes as a kit. Again, it, does, it doesn't come like this in the end. You um, get uh, rolls of tool material. Yeah, you got to make it. Yeah, you have to make it. So they show the instructions have uh, everything you need. So you get like the belt and you get the tool and you get um, needle thread and the battery pack connected to the LEDs. Uh, you have a needle threader. Um, and there's this little crochet hook that you use to like create the little tufts. Um, but, you know, I think, you know, a young person could probably do this in, in one day or maybe um, a weekend. That'd yeah, be good, easily. Good project. And then, it, again, it's not, it's not unaffordable. Like, it's, you know, about $20 or so. And um, I'll show the, the package. Oh, sorry. Package looks like this. Um, all in one. So, you know, eight, eight plus. But I think with, you know, adult supervision, it could be six plus. Yeah, and we do this for a living. 20 bucks is a really good deal. We're yeah. like, how are they doing this for 20 bucks? So it's good. Yeah, these, these are great. Okay. All right, next up. Also um, from Technician. Star of the show tonight besides you, Lady Ada, our community, our customers, and all those young engineers out there is a, another one. It's a sparkle tote. Again, a, a really great design because it's useful, and it's the details that make this wonderful. So it comes with um, these LEDs. It's a little tougher because with this one, you have to sew the LEDs on with conductive threads. So this one is like a little bit more advanced, I would say. I think, you know, you can still put it together, but you need to, um, it's not as easy as the, the tutu where everything kind of comes pre-wired. So um, this bag, I'll hold it up. Um, it has um, this nice print of a uh, happy unicorn. And then, you know, you can put the sparkles anywhere you want, but um, they sort of say, hey, you know, we recommend you you put them over the, the stars in the silk screen. So let me turn this back on. And like in most, in most cities, you're required to have a tote now. Yes. And here's a little detail that I really like. Inside is like a little, like a mini pocket. It's like a pocket. So your electronics sit in the pocket, the little battery pack um, gets attached here. And you can put like your wallet or you know whatever small item so it doesn't get like your keys so it doesn't go to the bottom of the tote and then the tote can hold like your your books or you know your change of clothes or whatever it is that you normally want to tote around and you don't have to worry about like your grocery shopping kind of yeah. leaking onto your, your led keys. tutu you can carry your led you tutu, carry your LED tutu. Yeah. so um a cute kit this one i think would be a little bit tougher um in my opinion just because you have to do the conductive uh Threading. So I think this one, I would say the unicorn horn is a, the easiest. Um, the twinkling tutu just has a little bit more that, you know, yeah, there's more that, construction. Then and then I think the tote would be third. So I think that's what you want to do. But all three of them are just like wonderful creative kits. I really dig these. All right. All right. All right. So that's that, our new products. It is new products. Twinkling. New, 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 new. 